In this video, I'll be going over four reasons of why you should shoot your B-roll with a macro lens. This is the Sony 90mm f2.8, the lens I use to shoot 90% of the B-roll on this channel. This is also a macro lens, which helps with getting detailed shots like these. The 90mm f2.8 helped me come up with the four reasons in this video. Now let's get into number one, sharpness. Macro lenses tend to be tack sharp, having the ability to get close to the subject and show every intricate detail is a must when shooting tech videos like the ones I make on this channel. And if you want to see more, consider hitting a like and subscribe to be notified when I post more. Number two, close focusing distance. Macro lenses tend to have a close focusing distance, which allows you to get close to the subject and getting up close on the subject is also great when capturing detailed B-roll shots of products. Paired with the sharpness, you will have some high quality b-roll shots which leads us to number three versatility for this one think of watching a video of one of your favorite tech photographers or videographer youtubers and pay attention to how they showcase the products and subjects in their videos there are always a wide medium tight and a detailed shot that helps with pulling you the viewer into the video with a macro lens you can achieve each shot you need with one lens even if it is a prime lens but most importantly you'd be able to get a specific type of detail shot like these right here. Yes, you can achieve the same thing with some editing magic or using a telephoto lens, but with a macro lens, even if it is a wide angle lens, you can still get close detail shots, a wide shot and other shots on your list with one lens, especially if you're running and gunning. This is all possible because of the sharpness, close focusing distance and macro capabilities. But if it is a macro zoom, then the world is your oyster. In the end, when it comes to shooting tech videos, we want to see the products. We want to see how the material look and we want to get up and close and personal with the project like we're actually there with it. Number four, thumbnails. Going back to number one, sharpness. Macro lenses tend to be so sharp that when shooting, you are able to get detailed shots that hold enough resolution to use a screen grab for your thumbnail, just like the one I used for this video. But if you actually take a photo for your thumbnail, don't be like me, then the better it'll show through on the tiny thumbnails on phones. Number five, the bonus. Macro lenses also show you that your gear is pretty dirty. Doesn't matter how much you try to clean it, there's always residual dirt because macro lenses are able to get all up in there and see what you miss. But keep your gear clean, although it isn't easy watch this video right here about what youtube thinks you may want to watch next if you got any value out of this video hit the like and subscribe while staying awesome stay awesome